We're at the Sean O'Brien 100K, and uh, I jumped up from the 50K just to take a shot at the, uh, the golden ticket. Really good. I'm nervous in a good way, in a way I haven't been nervous for in a long time, which is really exciting. So uh, I have a lot of unfinished business at Western, and so um, I feel like you only get so many chances in life for something, and I'm going to try to take a chance today. Ibuprofen. I just keep telling myself, I can be a beast in the last 24 miles. feels a little bit better but it's all about the head yeah. I want that spot now I don't want to give it up yeah. you know earlier I was like whatever <laughs> now I want to back down I don't know, something clicked, and maybe it was just the sense of like knowing what I'm capable of in later parts of a race. And I just kind of was like, I, I can do this, like I can push. I don't know, it just like turned over in my head and I just started running and like everything felt better. And, I, and then I just totally just owned it. That's what gives me that momentum. Everybody's hurting and 
I, then I was right. Like, I want this. Like, I want to win. I want to go to Western States, yeah, and when things weren't going well, that was enough for me, but I was like, no, you know, I want to win because I want myself to believe that this is who I am and what I'm capable of. I was scared actually coming in because I don't really know much about pacing and about how my body's gonna react. You go through highs and lows and everybody ebbs and flows. Um, and so, you know, I'm happy that I was able to like eke it out at the end. <laughs>